Holy guacamole! Sorry, kid. I did not see you there. What's your name, by the way, my friend? Nice name. My name is Alisa, and today I'll be your tour guide in the safari. So there are lots of animals in the safari, like some giraffes, zebras, maybe some tigers. But today, we are going to talk about cats. There are many cats in the safari. There are jaguars, tigers, lions, and deacons. What are the cats that we're going to talk about today? We're going to talk about domesticated cats. These are the cats which are called our pets that we have at home. By the way, did you know that cats use their whiskers to measure if they fit into small spaces? If their whiskers don't bend, that means they can fit. Cats have the same senses as the humans. They have sight, hearing, um, taste, touch and smell but cats senses are way better than humans they can see in the dark which means they're nocturnal some cats are nocturnal and then their teeth and their claws help them survive in the wild they can they use their ears because the ears they can hear things from far, far away, like you're in your, like your cat's in your house, and your cat hears that the neighbor's cats are fighting, and they have the smell. They can smell. They, they know which kind of odor is it. Did you also know that cats are born of blind and deaf? I'm going to show you something first. Come here, come here. This is my cat. Her name is Citrina. She was born of blind and deaf. On the first week, she started to hear and see. But the full hearing and seeing, it has to be fully become on the third week. On the fourth week, he started to climb and play. On the fifth week, he learned how to play with toys and other kittens. On the eighth week, he stops drinking milk. She has a full set of teeth and she learns how to poop. And then she learns how to eat solid dry and wet food. I'm going to tell you the parts of the cat because my cat is escaping so I have to do it really fast. So there's an ear, an eye, a nose, a muzzle, an elbow right here. Yep, I can feel it. There's a chest, a forelimbs, an abdomen, a hindi limbs, a stifle right here here at the back, a tail base, a tail, and a hawk. So those are the parts of the cat. If you're asking, what do cats eat? Well, I know the answers. Cats eat mice, rats, and small rodents. Some cats, they eat like moles, some rabbits, and birds. But the big wild cats that live in the safari, well, they eat other animals, but not cats, the big cats. Cats occasionally eat grass to clear up their stomach of, because of the indigestible food. Fur, bones, and feathers. You are asking this question of how they communicate. Well, 
I know the answer is too. The answer is that cats use facial expressions, different primes, and the and some hair, some of the fur from their back goes up and they wag their tail. Cats sometimes use yells and hisses when he when she or she's cat is fighting with someone else's cat. They use purrs when they want them to be pet on the head. My cat likes to be pet on her head. I hope you learned something today of this quick overview about cats. I hope you like my cat too. She kind of escaped from my arms. But remember, science is fun! Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays! See you next year! Bye!